a world where there's ice and fire dragons, night and light furies, and other vicious animals and creatures trying to kill us. This is hardcore Minecraft, but we're gonna be surviving 200 days taming dragons. Make sure you subscribe for the YouTube algorithm, and let's get a whopping one like on this video. Oh! 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 On day 101, as we were heading back home, we got ambushed by a pack of these crazy birds. They were pretty much bloodthirsty birds that eat humans. Yeah. Oh! Oh, no, 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 Bro, all the dragons are sleeping. I'm getting attacked by these oh, weird oh, things. Oh. Are you, you see them? Yeah. Ow, 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 ow. Take this. I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him. Bro, what the heck are these things? Are they not dragons? Ow. Where's my, yo, can you at least help me out, bro? I'm here, I'm here. Not even, oh, bro, who's this oh. guy? Yo, come on, you're paying rent or something? On day 102, we realized that building a house on a dragon's nest was probably the worst idea ever. We kept getting swarmed by a bunch of these dragons, and they kept messing us up. We had to relocate. Wait, what are you doing? Wait, you just... Just eating? Huh. Connor, there's three of them! There's literally uh -oh. three of them and they're oh, all no, coming no, through no. for the house! Whoa. I'm watching out, I'm watching out, bro. Oh, ow, 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 ow. I can't really oh. hit him, dude, you know that? Oh, oh, oh no, I had ow, 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 ow. 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 Use There's your literally what? two of them! Use your this is ridiculous! Okay. I'll get this one, you get the other I, one. I, I don't uh, know which I mean, one to hit. I, I literally can't even I'm just, like, they're like I'm just raiding us. They're raiding us, bro. Look at them! Are they funny? Oh, there's Yo, so many. We Yo, should we not. Our dragons. Oh, we have to. Let's go. Let's go. Get our dragons. Get our dragons. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, I'm starting to take a lot of damage. I am starting to take a lot of damage, bro. Why do I run so slow? Here, here, Ow! I have a few gold apples. Left. They're just putting me on fire. I know. They're everywhere. Dude, every single day we wake up and there's dragons attacking us. They, they're really not happy with us at all. No. So they, they, no. They've been I upset mean, us. We really stole their habitat. Boys! Help me out, your father's dying, come on! Look at them, they're just like... I'm, I'm literally their dad, and they just, this is how they treat me. <laughs> Thank you so much for roaring in my Wait, face. Can you now attack them? All right, boys, let's show them who's boss. So how do I breathe fire again? Oh, and this should be easy. Oh, I fell off the dragon. Uh -oh. Can you attack? Uh -oh. The dragon's in fire. Uh -oh. Attack, defend. Yes! Ah! Yes! 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 Oh! Go, 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 go! Oh, he's, he's just a, eating him! Oh, he's, he's just eating him! Eating him. <laughs> oh! I got him, I got him frozen, I got him frozen. There's another one right here. Okay, I got him. Run, he's low. Get him. Get him! Push the hook! Oh, oh, no, no, I'm about to die! Are, I'm about to die! Hurry up! Hurry up! Oh, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta this run. is so intense! He's dead, he's dead, he's dead, he's, oh, he's dead, dead, he's dead. Is ours alive? Oh. Uh, oh. Yes. No, don't look. He's just eating his body. He's just eating his body. Wow, my dragon's literally a savage. I raised you. I raised you so... I love you. This is why we're best friends. So after my dragon absolutely obliterated all the dragons, I started taking their blood. I know, it was, was kind of weird, but I had to do it. This was the only way to properly create some crazy armor sets. On day 103, we packed up our entire house. It was really sad. We had to leave everything behind and just kind of get going. So we set sail to a brand new location so we could start our very own dragon empire. And along the way, we came across a, uh, a sea shocker, apparently. Connor, we gotta pack everything up, bro, right now, okay? Oh. Uh, what are we, yeah. what are we doing with these pixies? I have all my shoulders over here, I, I but, uh, do we, do we, I don't like, know, man. Do we keep them here? This, this what, is their house wait, now. What? Huh? What? Okay. Whoa. I just, just lost a shulker. Uh -oh. Minecraft. Oh, <laughs> what? Huh? Did they steal it? I think they did. Oh, it's one free. It's one free. They, get, get rid of it. Oh. Oh, hey, we, just, we really chest. got rid of it. <laughs> Let's not forget our life fury as well. There we go. So the only unfortunate part is, well, what do we do with the other dragon? Um, we leave him. We just leave him behind? It's this house now. Can you please guard this house while we're gone? Yeah, yeah, okay. You got it. Yep. Jeez, bro, why are you so aggressive? What the heck, man? You destroyed the entire house! You just, just, ah! Oh, oh. Come on! Uh, yeah, it's, it's, like, I it's, didn't do it. There's, there's no coming back to that one at all. It's, it's completely gone. Yeah. Don't scream at me. Well, we're finally here. There's my ice dragon and it's trying to murder this other one over here. This guy does not seem to like us at all. Get him. Let's go. Eat him alive. And this is going to be the start of the dragon empire. A beautiful ocean view so we can see anything we want. A brand new biome, fancy trees, and even other dragons we can catch. It's even guarded by a crazy ice dragon. Connor? Connor, I I am telling you right now, I see a shark. I see like a, a shark? like a like a real shark. Yeah. Andrew, where are you? No, I'm I'm being serious. There's a shark. Oh, oh, okay. Look. Oh, they're having a fight. Wow. Uh, Let's go, bro. Yo. No more, my friend. No more. So can you control him, or is he just gonna like destroy the whole city I built? I honestly don't know what he's doing. I, he just you know I just let him be. He's kind of like a really boring dragon. So it's like oh, oh um, he might be um, um, uh, yeah. who's this? Hello. I... Hi. Whoa. Look at that, it's called a Blaze 
Falcon. Seems to be extremely friendly for some reason. Oh. Uh, oh, don't, don't. Hold on. I might be able to. Oh. Oh, he's actually trying to kill me now. Bro, what'd you do? What'd you do? I didn't mean to. Give me, like, at least, like, let's feed him. Let's feed him something, okay? Come here, buddy. I, I don't think he wants anything from him. Oh, oh wait, no. my, life fairy. Him. my life fairy is attacking him. Oh, there goes all that. This is the only way, my friend. What? No! What happened? My life fairy died! What? Get over here! Oh, I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die! No, 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 no! Oh, oh, yes, I'm alive! On day one of four, we started building our dragon empire. We started making some dragon cages to keep every single dragon in its own habitat. Connor, just keep on expanding it out. Now, how big are we gonna make it for every single dragon? I think um, definitely a life here can fit in here, no problem at all. Yeah, we, we want to like give them some space, right? Fat. You know, you can set the design pattern. Now, in the meantime, I want to go check out what is over there. I see a floating island somewhere in the distance. There's my life fury. Come on, buddy, let's get going. Oh, look at that! It's a floating island of some sort. Um, is there a dragon here? Oh, there is a dragon. Yo, wait a minute. There is a giant sea serpent currently doing backflips in the jungle biome. Um, that's happening. But check this out. It looks like some different dragon we haven't seen before. It's called a Storm Falcon Egg. So now we have officially two dragon eggs. And so we continued building our cage. The first one was officially done. And it looked pretty good. Then my ice dragon queen was just destroying the entire jungle. For some reason, I don't know. Well, this is pretty cool. There's the entrance. Now, we should probably put like a top part. So this way the dragons do not fly out because both well, they're dragons and they can yeah. fly. And some dragons are usually bigger than others. So we have to probably make this be a little bit bigger. And while Connor continued building the cage, I started setting up a very basic house to keep our items inside. I was going for like a log cabin type of house feel. All right, Connor, well, that should pretty much do it. Um, This is my house. What do you think? Uh, it's, uh, it's ugly. You know, listen, I'm not the best builder, okay? I'm I know, the professional I know, builder I here. <laughs> Would it trigger you if I just added in some jungle, jungle wood and stuff? You know? Oh my god, you're all about triggering me, huh? <laughs> and just like that, all the cages are ready, including our house. Well, that's a pretty good temporary house, I guess. Uh, it looks a little bit triggering, but it's completely fine. So let's place out a couple beds in here. Boom and boom. For now, this will do. Now, the official house will build later on. On day 105, I wanted something to be my right-hand man, like a different dragon. A Crimson Gorgoner. A dragon with moose antlers. I had to get it. So I traveled to the ice biomes and I found the nest. Hey, Connor, uh, while you're building the actual top of the cages, I'm going to go uh, do some exploration, okay. okay? Have fun. Don't die. I'll be back soon. Don't worry. Trust me. I have a knife here. <laughs> it's going to be fine. Yo, we're finally here. Check this out. So that house over there apparently contains... Oh, oh there's something there. There's an ice dragon. I repeat, there's an ice dragon. And some kind of yetis, apparently. What's up with the yetis? Uh, I'm gonna fire some shots at them real quick. Oh, this might not end well. This dragon is a little bit upset at me. Keep firing shots, let's go. I was being chased by an ice dragon. It was trying to kill my knife fury, but then I came across a village. Yo, what is in this village, bro? Park it up, park it up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh no, he's back. Yo, he's back for revenge. <laughs> he is literally back for revenge, bro. This dude is upset. Extremely upset at me. You kidding me? You're so weak, buddy. That's it. It's over. Now this guy doesn't seem so. Oh, he's not friendly at all. Ow! I kept getting attacked by evil yetis as my knife here just kept on watching. On the bright side, I brought some of these uh, glass bottles, so more blood from these dragons and the crazier armor I can get. Yo, is an elf here? It looks like a pretty evil elf. I don't trust him. Oh! What? My knife for you blew up. Um. Uh, okay. Hey, just like that, my knife fear was dead. Dude, what in the world? Where am I? Is that a... Something is not right. Open this up. Uh, what is... What's going on here? <laughs> it's just a giant door. Open up! Santa Claus, where are you at? I'm here for the dragon. Okay, fine. Don't let me inside. Are you friendly? You seem to be kind of friendly. He's not friendly. These elves are not friendly. They try to kill me. No, oh, bad elves, bro. Where's my dragon egg? I'm taking everything here. Oh, there it is. This is the one. This is the one I was talking about. That should be a crimson gore gutter. Oh, yeah. That's definitely it. It even looks like it has moose antlers. Let's go. Perfect. Ta-da. Ooh, some diamonds. Yo, Connor, I'm coming back home. Okay, buddy? Okay. On day 106 and 107, we were exploring a brand new biome. It was called the Lightlands. And as we were exploring, we came across these fake trees that kept trying to kill us. Connor, I have brought some souvenirs. I have a toy soldier. Okay. Um, I got a teddy bear. I know, I know you like to sleep with like a little teddy bear. Aww. Just in case. I got you, buddy. Um, and, I, and I put the toy soldier for you because you're, you're the kid, technically. <laughs> yeah. 
I totally forgot how to hatch these dragons. Do we just like place them down and that's it? Or do we have to put them in here? Oh, oh. <laughs> oops. Oh, I remember now. So we gotta put one in here and then another one over here. So I'll put the I'll put the crimson one. Actually, I think they all go into this one right here. And then all we need is some water. So we began our incubation process. We were waiting for a dragon eggs to hatch. Connor, I'm I'm out of here, buddy. I gotta go explore some land, okay? I'll okay. be back soon. Uh what are you what are you building here? Is this our house? Yeah, that's gonna be about my house. What's what's wrong with my house? <laughs> um, you know, it's kind of small for me. Yeah, it's just... bro, what? This dude. I see a dragon in the distance. It's sleeping currently. It looks like. What kind of dragon is that? A blaze falcon dragon. That's pretty cool. Whoa. What are these things? Is that a tree? Wait, what? This is kind of sus. Uh, are you guys friendly? Oh, oh, I'm being attacked by trees. Why are the trees attacking me? Hey, back up! Yo, get out of here! They're so slow! Look at these dudes! Yay! Yay! What's up, bro? What? What's good? You want some of this? Huh? Yo, these, tra these trees do not stand a chance! And a weird, like, rainbow spider. Look at that thing. What is that? Ow! Get this dude out of here. And then on day 108, I found a Pegasus and got myself a Gladius Egg. The Lightland. So I don't know what this is supposed to be, but it's a brand new biome. There's even a dragon sleeping in the distance. A silver dragon. Kind of looks like a, uh, a griffin, you know? Oh! I came across a Pegasus, and I wanted to tame him and put on the team. Oh! I just found a Pegasus! Wait, 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 wait. Do not leave. Do not leave. Do not leave. Hold on a second. Stay here. Stay here, buddy. What is that over there? Hey, Connor! Do you have a saddle yeah. by any chance? A saddle? I need you to drop off a saddle for me. Okay, yeah. I'll come. Yeah, I'm coming. Yo! I have a Pegasus! I don't no even have to do anything. You I'm telling you, bro. It's, it's, you, no, I don't even need a saddle. Oh, it's okay. I'll deal. Home. This is sick. Okay, I don't know what this dragon is, but I'm gonna quickly take it. What is that? Uh, a gladius dragon egg. Then on day 109, we started building up our entire base, expanding it, and getting our dragons inside their habitats. There we go. Swans again, just flying around without any rules. Yo, I, I'm I'm worried that he's gonna land on our house and destroy uh, everything. I think he's gonna. Do oh, okay, okay, okay. okay Are you okay. sure? I, I think we should huh. be fine. But look, yeah. I got a Pegasus. How cool is this? Amazing. Okay, can fly? so no. Yeah, I can I can do anything. So let's just drop him drop him off somewhere. Uh, why are there why are there parrots here? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know okay. they flew right in. They're like, oh cow. <laughs> All right, makes sense. Yep. Makes sense. Yep. So here's the thing. Now I wanna I wanna put him somewhere. It's kind of hard to contain him, so I'm not sure where to put him exactly. So for my ice dragon, I decided to make him a base. I froze the entire lake and turned it into his very own house, I guess. Listen, he was a very big dragon to take care of. I think this should do. Um, yeah, what do you think, buddy? You know? <laughs> you saw it? Um, well, I kind of wanted like hey, an ocean Hey, hey, where are you going? I, you give me so much trouble. Why, why do you do this to me? Come back here. No, stop wandering. Bro, this dude. Maybe I can bribe him with food. You want food? Oh no. Oh, Connor? Oh, Connor? No. Connor? <laughs> Connor? Yeah. Oh! No! 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 Wait, did he work it? Oh! Oh! oh yeah. It's just yeah. not making it better! It's oh! Gone. It's oh! Gone. Oh! It's gone! Oh, it's gone. No. no! No, 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 no! No! You house! And half our progress was gone just like that because my dragon decided to be dramatic. We're gonna do it by like an 11 block separation. So one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. Now, we could split this up a little bit more. Uh, the only issue is, Connor, the, the, yeah. the way you put your house here, uh, I'm kind of worried about it, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, like, yeah, we don't really have that much space. We only have like two dragon pens. That's about it. And now we have to rebuild this entire place here. All of it is completely gone. On the bright side, our dragon our dragon egg is actually ready. Nice. From day 110 to 112, we're looking for a crazy dragon named Screaming Death. A very powerful dragon that looked so evil and very, very vicious. He was located in the swamp biome. Yo, Connor, the house looks pretty good from here. Thank I like you. It. it would be a shame if my dragon just destroyed oh, the no. whole thing. Please, <laughs> not again. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. okay. So here's the thing, buddy. Oh, he's sleeping. Oh, he's so cute, bro. Aww. Wake up, buddy. We got to go. Let's go. Come on. We got a pretty important day ahead of us, okay? So there's a very powerful dragon called the Screaming Death. And this dragon is like no other at all, okay? We have to go find him right now. I hear something. What is that? Whoa. Are those spiders? Oh! Oh, there's a spider attacking me! Oh! Oh, what's going on? Yo! Oh, no. Oh, no. Chill. 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 Yo, Connor. Uh, I might have yeah. found some kind of a weird nest next to our house. Um, just, just don't worry about it. 
Okay. Bro, where's lava when I need it? Fireball on nest, buddy. Get it. Ooh, they poisoned you. Ow, ow, that's gonna hurt. Ow, fish. I'm raiding this nest full of these weird stinger creatures. It's like a scorpion. I'm rolling the And they're all gone. Wow, that was that was kind of close. Oh wow, it's like an underground system. Yo, it keeps going. Should I should I follow it? Yeah. Um, I don't know about this. I'm just trying to get my dragon, dude. This is a swamp bottom, and this is some kind of like a weird nest. I'm inside the jungle. Is that a? That's a very big one. That's a big one. That is a big one. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, oh, are you okay? Oh no. yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, oh there's, more. Uh, there's okay. more of them. There's way more of them. Yeah, I'm, I'm completely fine. Don't worry about me. Okay. I'm, I'm fine. Yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, 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 there's so many of them. There's so many of them. Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> let's just not talk about it. Let's just let's just not talk about it. We're, we're cutting it way too close. Okay. We gotta find the screaming death, especially while still sleeping. And there was in the distance a screaming death. Just flying through, shooting out poison. I had to have him. I see him. I'm on the way. There's like three of them in the sky. There's got to be a bunch of these eggs. We're going to have all three of them. Oh, they're having a battle. So it should be somewhere around at any time now. <laughs> should be somewhere around here. That's a swamp biome. It's mixed in with all these. And then this is, I don't even know, the light lands apparently. Finding a screaming death nest was not going to be easy. It was actually buried inside of the ground and it took about a couple of minutes to actually find. Okay, so where is he landing? He's Oh, they're both level 100. Ooh, they look so dangerous. Hey, what is this? Uh, oh, skeleton. Yay. Get this dude out of here, bro. What you think you're doing? Zombies? What is, what is it? Oh, check this out. It's like a nest. And where exactly does this lead to? Oh, that's gotta be it. Oh, it's sleeping. Oh, it's definitely sleeping. Wow, that thing you do not want to mess with. That's scarier than a Night Fury. So how are we going to do this? Am I just going to go in there? Where's the egg exactly? Oh, there's the egg. Oh, you know what? I got a better idea. Let's just not get him mad at all. What if I go from this side and I just dig straight down? <gasps> this is why you never dig straight down. This is why you never dig straight down. That was so lucky. <laughs> a screaming death egg. Do I like get him mad? Do I do it? There's like diamonds over there. Kind of. I kind of want the diamonds. I think I'll be fine. I mean, it is sleeping though. Hey, buddy. Stay still. Stay still. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna let you be. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, that was sus. Oh, there's more diamonds. No way. Let's go. Yes. This is some pretty cool blocks as well. These are uh, lava cobbles. Oh, no. <gasps> oh! Run! 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 Nope! 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 And just like that, I went back home. I was not trying to die today. On day 113, as Connor continued to build this house, I went to a bunch of villagers and I started stealing all their loot. Those blacksmiths' chests contain some really, really good stuff. Connor, you don't even want to know what just Hello. happened, bro. I'm, I'm finally back home, bro. But uh, no, you are. This is pretty cool, bro. Uh, hey! Do you think it's a little bit excessive for a house? It's like literally bigger no. than the dragon cage. No, it's not. Just wait. You've literally spent like over 20 days on this, bro. I hope you know. Oh, yeah. My eyes are closed right now. I'm still building. Okay. Well, you, you keep building. I'm just going to keep dropping off random blocks I found for you, but I'm going to go raid okay. a bunch of villages, okay, them. buddy? Yo, Connor, do we have any more lava on us? Lava? Uh, I haven't got some in a while, but I could go grab some. Yeah, grab some lava for us and just incubate this egg in here, okay? Yeah. I got one we'll incubated. I'm just trying to make sure we have every single egg incubated. Yeah, this one definitely requires lava. Now that I'm a sea shocker egg incubated, I'm just going to place him down here and we're going to call him. Ah, uh, ah, uh, sea dude, yeah, like the jet ski. Oh, he's so cute. Look at this dude. His name is Sea dude. Let me use the rest of my treats. Uh, I don't have any more left, I guess. But there you go. He's kind of cute. Look at this dude. It's like a little um, I don't even know. But uh, I'm gonna keep you in a dragon orb. Oh no, is he too small for a dragon orb? Oh, I got him. There we go. Sick. Ta-da. And now we officially have two dragons on the team. So I summoned my knife fury, and I went looking for a bunch of villages. Eventually, that hole that I came across where I was, like, dying, I was going to come back to that. I had to get revenge. But at first, I needed lava for those pesky bugs. Okay, there we go. This is the first village. Is there anybody in here? Ah, there are some villagers in here. 
Hello, Mr. Villager. Don't, don't mind me, guys. I'm just here for all your loot. Oh, there's lava in here. <laughs> Perfect timing. Oh, some diamonds. Let's go. Anything interesting? Nope, nothing at all. Two buckets of lava. This was revenge for almost killing me in hardcore mode. Oh, man, he looks mad. He knows it's about to happen to him, right? I think he knows. Yo, where's my stew? I should probably get the stew on me. That was, that was way too close. That's it. There we go. Perfect. Yes. Got it. Ugh. Let's go. I'm ready, boys. I'm taking precautions this time. I know they're super weak to fire. I can just feel it. And boom, I flooded the entire place with lava. Oh, man. That sucks for you, buddy. No, he does not seem to like that. <laughs> no, he does. Oh, did they drop anything good? Ow. No, they poison you with their stinger. Oh. I was close. Jungle, Mirmix. What is this jungle thing? Ooh, I can make some armor, apparently. I destroyed all the eggs, and that's it. I set on a journey to find more villagers. Are you guys friendly? You, you want chicken? What are you? What, what was that? Huh? I have no idea what this thing is. It's kind of cool. Do you like fish? Okay, no, no fish for you, then. <laughs> what is this? Oh! Oh! A scarab. Huh. Interesting. What's in here? Ain't even a blacksmith. Hello, my friend. I'm here to steal all your stuff. Sorry about that. Ooh, diamond horse armor. I mean, we don't have horses, but we'll just go with it. Check this out. Some weird structure. I think I found another dragon. Oh, it's, it's gotta be another dragon, right? Oh, there's gold. Let's go. Let's go. So what is, what is in here? Nothing? A dead body. Oh, jeez. And there's the egg. Look, another one. This is a, um, what kind of a dragon is this? A Nightbringer egg. Interesting. I think that's the Nightbringer. I'm not sure if he's going to be so happy that it destroyed his entire base. I found an army of, of lizard people. There's, oh, what are these? It's another one of these weird caves. Ow, ow, ow. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. Stop me. Stop me. Stop me. Stop me. I need a long sword. Oh, it's there. Oh, jeez. Not this again. Oh, this, this is like giving me like a throwback, bro. Bro, get out of here. What the heck is going on? Ow! Oh, I'm about to die. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that was a close one. And on day 114 to 116, we came across some more villagers, raided them, and then we got attacked by lizard people. More and more lizard people. Okay, this one might not be worth it. There's a dragon there. He's sleeping. Um, I'm pretty sure I saw lizard people there. It was, it was just here, actually. I don't know where it went. Um, but I'm a little bit worried about that guy. Oh, there they are. Yo, I'm going to get these dudes. There they are. What are they, what are they even doing in here? And what are they protecting or guarding? Who are they waiting for? Who are you waiting for? And while I was on my way to another village, I came across a weird structure. This is going to be super useful. I'm not sure what we can really use it for. But hey, at least we want to travel. Now we got it. An obelisk. That's what it is. Okay, so I guess I'll take that with us. I'll take a few of these blocks as well in case we want to have a cool little design. What is that? Is that, a, is that a person? They don't look so friendly. Um, what? It? Oh no! Oh, he's not friendly. That guy was not friendly. Ah! Oh no! Not again! Not again! Not again! Nope! 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 Get out of here! Bad dragon! Bad dragon! Yo, he kind of sucked though, low key. Uh, let's go, baby. What's good? Where'd he, where'd he go? Huh? Whoa! You dropped the key! What is that? A key for, a key for what exactly? Shadow Nation Dungeon Key! Oh! Connor! Yeah? Remember we talked about this before? The Shadow Nation Dungeon Key? Yeah, it yeah, I remember that. It was supposed to be for the Shadow Nation Dimension? This should come in handy in 300 days of taming dragons. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and leave a like on this video, by the way. You don't want to miss any of our videos. Trust me, they are absolutely fire. And then from day 117 to 120, as I was going back home, I came across a really cute frog dragon named Frogon. I had to take him. He reminded me of my best friend, Unspeakable. Oh, what is this? What is this for? There's a, there's a person here. Whoa, whoa, sir, sir. Whoa, he just said ribbit. What's good, bro? So this was underneath this entire place. I'm not sure if it goes anywhere else. Oh! Oh! What is that? Oh! What just happened? I got attacked by a frog ninja. So I got a heavy door key, a ninja token, and a frog key. Um, I'm a little bit confused here. So can I open this? Or where does it go to? Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Interesting. 
Hello? What? Where am I going? And just like that, I traveled to some kind of a weird frog dimension. I am extremely confused where I am. I don't know what's happening. And there's an army of frogs attacking me. Wait, what? I'm in some kind of a weird frog dungeon. And I gotta kill all the frogs. Oh! A frog wizard! What is going on? Why am I inside of a frog dimension? <laughs> so I went through the frog dimension looking for some kind of a secret item, I guess. I didn't really know how to get out of there. It looks like the frogs are not going to stop spawning. And then I found some meditating frog dude. Whoa, wise old frog. Wait, you can give me a ninja robe? No way. I, I actually need this. This is sick. Whoa, a ninja sword? Dude, I want to be a ninja. Dude, I, what? Sir? Sir? You and I are going to be best friends. I need everything you have. Oh! Got another one. And finally, I had enough tokens. Yo, this dude is super cool. And I need... Oh, jeez. Are you guys kidding me? Can you just give me some time real quick? Okay, so let's get it real quick. I want to get this. Yes! Okay, Um, I, I don't really need a sword. But I just wanted the helmet. I want to see how I look like with a ninja frog hat. Here we go. Ninja frog hat. I am Moose the ninja. Now, let's get out of here. I'm tired of dealing with all these frogs. Way too many frogs, okay? So, let's grab these dungeon keys. Boom. Open that up. Another one. Boom. Boom. And boom. Oh. I think he's sleeping at level 50. I don't know what that is. I think it's like a frog dragon, apparently. Should I disturb him? There's, there's the entire, uh, yeah, that thing. What is this? Oh. <gasps> Yo, wait a minute. What is in here? A frog in costume chest plate. Oh, okay. We're doing this, I guess. I got the egg. Um, interesting. Look at this. A frogon egg. I was ready to go home, but I kind of wanted to fight the frogon. Sir, I, I really want to fight you. He's a vegetarian. Can I, can I give you food? Do you, do you want this, sir? Like, I'll, I'm just going to feed you some food, okay? All right. I, I don't want to make this weird. So you kind of seem sad. I'll, I'll help you out if you want me to. I'll let you be for now. Okay, sir. I'm out of here. And from day 121 to 135, I spent most of my time getting a bunch of these falcon eggs. I had to get the storm falcon, the blaze falcon, and the foley falcon eggs. So I can take all three of them, combine them, and create a hybrid dragon. I'm back home, Connor. Um, what do you do here? What is this? What did you build here? Um, a lot of things. Oh, yes, an enchanting room. Can you do level yeah. 30 enchants, though? Oh, you can. That's kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's huh? pretty sick. A little watchtower so you can see a dragon. Yeah. A little dock area. The house is officially finished. That's pretty cool. So we have one incubator and then another incubator. So this is the guy that we always incubated. The yeah, screaming death is incubated. incubated. Yo, this is good. All right, officially, I'm going to call you Roar. <laughs> Yo, oh, oh he's so cool. Oh, he's just a kid. Dude, he's adorable. Come here, buddy. Wow, he's actually really adorable. Okay, look at this dude. He's going up. He's dude, a making me so proud. Yeah, I see it now. Ta-da! I'm gonna incubate the Frogon egg next, and now we gotta go through the jungle and create a hybrid dragon. It's time. Also, give me that. Uh, what, what are they called again? Oh, uh, they call the dragon orbs. I need one more for this guy. Oh, dragon orbs. I got you. Oh, is this, is this the one I need? Uh, this is a a oh a storm falcon. Yes. So the nest should be. Right there. There we go. And so I got every single falcon egg just like that. I got another one. Let's go. Okay, so now I actually want to have one of each. Actually, I want to have two of each egg. This way, I can have the actual dragon plus the hybrid dragon as well. So I'll use three of them for the hybrid dragon. And then one of each will be for the actual dragons themselves. And this should be the fully falcon egg. Perfect. There we go. So all we need is two more of these eggs. Jungle temple. Let's go. Yo, what you got for me in here, huh? What you... Oh. Nothing at all. Come on, bro. Hey, I'm, I'm just going to take this. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. No hard feelings, right? Are you mad? I don't... Oh, all right. She's fine. She's fine, I guess. <laughs> got another one. Yeah. And just like that, I had every single egg I needed. Are you mad? Are you uh, mad? Did you make him mad? I don't know. Oh! Oh, oh he's back! Oh! Toad! Uh oh Bro, what the heck? Oh, oh he's gone. He's gone now. He's gone. <laughs> all right, so we officially got it all. So anyways, let's drop it off in here and start incubating them. Now, how do we combine them, Connor? What are you thinking, bro? 
Uh, I'm gonna um, first incubate every single one that we can. I'm incubating the Frogon egg, and I think the Storm Falcon egg goes inside of this incubator. I'm pretty sure. Definitely the Blaze Falcon goes in here. Yo, why don't we make upgrades for the incubators, bro? I already upgraded them fully. Wait, what? They're, they're all level five? Yeah. <laughs> I just, How do you I tell? I upgraded another one. They're, look at them. Level yeah, you're five. Right. You are right, actually. They are level five. Okay, well, we got another one. I mean, these are, like, kind of cheap to make. I say we get, like, two of each then. Oh, it's almost ready, dude. Let's go. Yo, we're gonna need a lot of dragon treats. And from day 136 to 159, we started creating a hybrid dragon. It was an extremely long process. To create this three-headed beast, we had to mix every single falcon together, and that was not gonna be so simple. To actually get one, we had to obtain the DNA from each falcon, and then mix them into an iron egg. Step number one is craft an empty DNA orb. So, empty DNA orb. Got it. Oh, well, that's really easy. Mana glass is mana infused iron. Oh, even easier. Let's begin the grind. Boom. Then we're gonna need some glass. Connor, do you have any glass? Uh, yes, I do. Let me come give it. We also need gold ingots. Boom. All right, and then and the last part is gonna be a crafting table. And just like this. There's two. And three. Now we're gonna need a DNA extractor. Wow, that's really easy. So we gotta take this weird contraption and start extracting DNA. The worst part is we gotta actually have the dragon. So I was a little bit wrong about this. Now I got my Nightbringer here. I also have my Frogon, so he's ready to go. Let's go and actually place these two down real quick. Well, you know what? We'll hatch them later. How about that? I don't wanna get it all mixed up. My Crimson is almost done. And there's my first Blaze Falcon egg. So this is the egg that we actually need. So we're gonna call him Blaze Falcon. Now we gotta get, take this dude over here and get him up to level 100. So we're gonna need a lot of dragon treats, over 300 dragon treats. My Crimson is ready. He's an adult, let's go. Okay, now he's kinda hungry though. He looks like a chicken dude, look at this dude. Yeah, yeah, that's a little rude. Yo, my knife here has been starving this entire time. This Aww. poor dude was mad. Okay, so we officially have every single falcon right here, all right? Now, the only thing left over is going to be, uh, well, leveling these guys up. So that's, where are you going? What is he doing? He doesn't, just doesn't listen to me. Doesn't listen to me at all. All right, so you're level 99 and you're level 100 now officially. Okay, and you are also level 100. Wait, this is not mine. What? This is mine. I was like, wait, what's going on? I was so confused right now. All right, so the next step is extracting all the DNA from every single one of these falcons. Okay, I got one. Now it's got a cooldown. Oh, I got a fully Falcon DNA. There we go, perfect. Okay, now the next one is gonna be the Blaze Falcon DNA. There's another one right there. Blaze Falcon check. And the final one. So all three Falcons are good to go. Now we're gonna make a DNA combiner. DNA combiner is ready to go. Boom, that looks pretty fancy. So we're gonna put in every single one of these DNAs in here. One, two, three. Ooh, look at this. Yo, you can make a Frog Ace. Wait, you can take a Storm Fury and combine it with a Night Fury and a Bone Fury. Yo, we gotta do this for 300 days of dragons. Who wants to see it? Leave a like. All right, we gotta make a Hydra. Now we need an Iron Egg. All right, we got it. So take this, put it into here, and it's ready to go. Oh, it's combining it. It's making it. This is sick. Okay. Our egg is ready. All right, there's the Hydra Egg. So we take this and we have to incubate it. He's got to go inside of one of these. Oh, there's the Drake egg. Is that also ready? Uh, the Gladius egg is not ready. All right, there we go. I officially have a DNA incubator. And so the incubation process begins. So these are all the eggs that are all ready to hatch. Let's start off with the Drake egg. What the heck? Connor! Yeah. Your dragon just killed my Drake. Um. The baby. It was right in front of me. Just died. Cause of my dragon. Can I'm. It's gone. Yeah. Oh, go back to bed. What the heck? Oh my! <laughs> wow, nature, you're scary. On day 160 to 167, we hatched every single one of our eggs. And while we were searching for some desert temples, we came across a new dragon. His name was Bone Napper or something. We snuck in and stole the egg. So now I got a Nightbringer. It's another one right here. Nightbringer. He's so cute. 
This is adorable. The Crimson Dragon. Crimson. He looks like a moose! Oh, he's adorable! Look at him! He's all thick. Hey, you stay away. You stay away, Light Fury. Alright? You better not touch this guy. Yo, you Light Fury sus! Is he? Yo! Is he causing trouble yo, again? Yo, literally! What's going on with him? Oh my god. Him so yo, you know what? I'm done with this guy. I'm out of here, bro. Me too. Get this dude out of here, bro. Hey! Can you not? Bro! Ugh. Oh! Ah. Uh. <laughs> Yo, uh, <laughs> yo, um, the Blaze Falcon was mad. <laughs> and then the Frogon egg. Frogon, let's go. Yo, he's so cute and he's so small. I should have called you unspeakable. All right, so now we have a total of, wow, that's a lot of dragons. Oh yeah, 12 dragons, not bad at all. Crack this egg by shift right click in the incubator. Okay, all right. Ugh. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. What's going on? That's it? It's done? The Hydra Egg is officially ready. And this is it. The Hybrid Dragon. Uh, I'm just going to call him Hydra. Hydra should be fine. <laughs> oh. Oh, there it is. Look at this dude. So it's every single falcon head. There you go. That is super cool. Kind of interesting for sure. Not bad at all. Bone. Napper, there we go. Ta da! Look at this dude, he's pretty cool. So, here's the thing now, we apparently do have one of the legendary dragons, if you want to call it that, I guess. So, it turns out, of course, the Bewilder Beast, the Red Death, they're extremely popular and large dragons. Now, we can't actually get those, but we do have the Crimson, which is one of the biggest ones as well. So, I'm gonna get him to level 100 in the next couple of days, but first, let's get Clang over here. What's up, Clank? Welcome to the team, buddy. You look pretty cool, dude. And we also gotta get Screaming Death also to level 100. They're like the ultimate dragon. So Screaming Death and, of course, the Crimson is super powerful. Yo, what's goody, buddy? Get over here. Where you going, dude? Yo, why, why is this dude always flying away from me? Yo, go sleep. Oh, he's so cute when he sleeps. Now, do not underestimate the Screaming Death because, yes, he's extremely powerful and he gets very, very big. So we're gonna go find a Nader and the Zippleback. And this is the thunder drum, apparently. Bro, look at that breath. That's crazy. We're officially here. Now, what exactly is that over there? That kind of caught my eye. An elemental. Interesting. Oh, there's Nader. Yo, what's up, Nader? How you doing, buddy? Oh, this guy looks awesome. That thing's majestic as well. If this guy's here, then the entire egg should be somewhere around this area. There's another one over there. So there's like two of them. Oh, I think he's bad. I'm pretty sure he's bad. What is this? It's hay bells? Let's go! We got the Nader Egg. Perfecto. Alright, so all we got left is a Zippleback. And there's like a really small one over there sleeping. What is this guy doing? What exactly are you? Oh, it's Silva. And then this is a another Nader, right? Oh, it's a different color Nader. Interesting. There it is! The Zippleback! Let's go! Alright, buddy. Uh, what are- uh. Okay, don't look at that. Don't, don't even look at that thing. <laughs> oh, look at the Zippleback go. Okay. Super close. There's another one over there in the corner. There it is. The actual zipple back nest. We're taking the egg. Let's go. Okay, we better run because this guy's going to be a little bit upset at me. Nope, 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 nope. And just like that, we got the zipple back and the nader eggs. And while we waited, we leveled up our Screaming Death. Aw, look at the Night Fury and the uh, Screaming Death getting along. It's kind of a coincidence because if you guys saw the animations and stuff. Well, I guess it was a TV show. I think it was called uh, Dragon's Defender of Burke. They had some beef. So having them together right now is pretty a legendary moment. Now where's my moose at, bro? Where's my dude at right here? This is him right here, the Crimson. I gotta get him on my team. I have not even leveled him up yet. But apparently it's one of the biggest land dragons. Come on, buddy, eat up. Yo, his teeth are getting big. Oh yeah. Oh, he's eating me! Yo, Connor, watch this, ready? Look at this dude. Yeah. <laughs> The Nader egg is officially ready, and the Zipple back as well. Let's go! All right, welcome the Zipple back to the family. This is a dragon empire. Look at this dude. And here is the Nader. Ta-da! Oh, so adorable. Absolutely adorable. 
Well, I gotta say, the Dragon Empire is definitely going for sure. We have everything we pretty much need. From day 182 to 186, we wanted to go to the Fire Nation dimension. We had to find these Fire Nation encampments or something like that. They're pretty much scattered all across the world. And once you looted them, they would actually give you these map pieces. And once you craft all the map pieces together, all three of them, they will give you the Fire Nation map. So we started flying through the sky looking for these pieces. And we came across the same Red Death as before. And while I was flying, a dragon literally came out of nowhere and almost killed me. Oh, wow. This guy, this guy is really, this guy's not having it. Yo, why is this guy so evil? Yo, chill, bro. Back up. You just destroyed my red, I mean, my screaming thing. Yeah. Bro, back up. Keep your distance. You don't want none of this. I'm telling you. You see what happens? Look at that. Look at you, bro. How you feel? And as I found one of these camps, I got attacked by another dragon. There was something about me, man. I was like a dragon magnet for whatever reason. But luckily, Connor was there to help me out. You know, Connor, I'm honestly worried for our safety. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think so many dragons. I, what I don't they? understand. They like look at you from a mile away and they just yeah. want to eat us. And they're just like, what's <laughs> fire? Literally, yeah, they just ruin the day. I mean, at least we have a bunch of the dragon blood things. So this way. Oh, what yeah. is that? Yo, he's thick. Yo, look at this guy. Yo, get over here. Stay. Wait a minute. I want to. I want to see him. What is that thing? It's like a thick gronkle. So that is apparently the catastrophic quaking. Interesting. Yeah, never heard of it before. And that's another nader, and then another one with a different color. It's like the dad of gronkle. Something's happening. I think oh. they're having a battle. Oh yeah. Oh, it, it's it's uh -oh. a battle, bro. I'm trying to level this dude up, but no, nah, they're just going at it. And there it was. The camp that we were looking for. At first I was confused what it was, but then boom, there it is. And in the distance, I saw something else. We weren't really sure what it was. But we gotta check it out. Connor, we're here. Um, dude, so. let's take this. This is sick. Yeah, this you is kidding cool. me, bro? Oh yeah, take this with us, bro. Are you kidding me? These are we're sick. Good. We're gonna put this all in front of our house. Come to the dark side. <laughs> and right next to it is a village. That's pretty cool. Alright, well, I, I guess we'll just we'll just take it with us. Um, let's grab those hay bells as well, just in case. We gotta really start decorating our place, man. I mean, it, it's cool and all, but like it needs like these kind of cosmetic things everywhere, like a campfire. Yeah. And random things. Um, what's in the chest? A Fire Nation map part. There we go. Oh. That's going to be one piece of what we need. And now we're going to find two more all around the map. And then we should be good to go. Let's get rid of these things. So let's go loot the village in the meantime. And then go over to the next thing over there. Let's look at another camp. Is there a blacksmith? There's got to be a blacksmith. <laughs> Where's he at? Yeah, there's definitely nothing here. Nope, nothing. Empty. Yo, by the way, uh, here's, a, here's a helmet for you, bro. I don't know why you walk around with no helmet. Yeah, that's another camp over here, bro. Check this out. Look at this. Sick. Here. Grab grab this. Grab this. And grab the tents. Oh, they got an anvil in here. And another bed. Yeah, I'm taking it all. I just want one that's actually here. <laughs> hey, there it is. Fire Nation. Peace, baby. Let's go. A spike fruit. Diamond crystal shard. What is that for? Diamond crystal shard. I don't know. A dragon texture for clang. And fire resist resistance potions. Those are probably going to be useful. Ooh, I got a Fire Nation sword and a Fire Nation spear. I don't know what just happened, but I think my dragon killed somebody. And I got a Fire Nation dungeon key, apparently. So, at nighttime, these mobs that were here spawn, and they drop these dungeon keys for the dungeons, I guess. So, we gotta be careful, man. We gotta get everything we can. Check this out. The Fire Nation spear. You ready? I'm gonna test it out. I'm not sure if it does anything different. Here's a sword. Aha! Yeah, that sword is, like, really powerful. And there we were at the final camp that was left. This was going to be the final piece we needed. It's burning down, but there's this dude over here trying to attack me. Look, 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 look. Heavy door key, heavy door key. Look. Ooh. Yeah, let's farm yeah. them. Farm them, bro. We need the keys. Okay. I'm going to loot everything they have here. But, yeah, let's just stay here real quick and keep farming these guys. Why do I even have a regular diamond sword anymore? Ooh. Ow, 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 ow. There it is. All right. That's three pieces total. Okay, so I, I say we uh we gotta wait. You know what I mean? I wanna keep farming them. Ow! Chill, bro. Alright, they keep dropping it too. Are you seeing the same key over and over though? Uh yes, but I'm pretty sure I mean the last time oh, I did I, the frog I, I, I one. Got a tier two dungeon key. Oh, so yeah, there there's different tiers, that's what I'm saying. I have a tier one as well. So what I'm guessing is there's a bunch of doors in that specific location, right? And pretty much, like, that's the same thing as the frog level that I was at. It was, like, a bunch of different doors they had to open up, like, almost, like, seven doors. So the fact that oh, I had okay. all the keys, 
I was just ready. I didn't have to wait. On day 187, we kept on farming these Fire Nation mobs. We kept getting a bunch of different keys and we were ready to craft the actual map. I got a Fire Nation tier 3 dungeon key. Let's craft it, boys. Let's go. All right, buddy. But first, we got to set this up around the house, okay? We need a bunch of these tents everywhere. Okay. Look at that. That's uh -huh. a pretty solid spot. Let's put one there. And then another one right here. Aha. And here are these, like, weird banner things. We'll put them, like, on the water edges. We are Fire Nation. Fire Nation Ooh. Zoku. <laughs> no one shall attack us. Bro, we have so many tents. Okay, got it. Thank you. There we go. Our small little camp is officially set up. It is pretty packed. If we had villagers, it'd be pretty cool. Boom, boom, and boom. Fire Nation map. All right, Connor. We're ready to go. Ta-da! And so we got teleported to the Fire Nation dimension. The first thing we saw were enemies attacking us and somehow a dragon. What was it doing here? Bro, can you believe this guy? You see the dragon? Look. Yeah. What, like There's what? A, a few dragons. This one behind this one is. Oh, watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch, out, watch these guys! Watch these guys! So, what is the tower over there in the distance? I don't see, know. Right? Bro. Let's go it's to a massive oh, castle. What is this? On day 188 and 190, we walked through this crazy dimension, and we kept on climbing up these giant pillars all around us. There was tons of mobs trying to kill us, but luckily we survived. And yes, we did have a lot of close calls. Uh, Whoa! Spider, but fire. That's a different one. That is a... Yeah, that's a, like a weird spider. What the heck is going on, bro? Interesting. Looks like we're in a brand new dimension. And there is my screaming death, ready to fight. Uh oh can you help me? Um, um... You good? There's bigger ones. Uh... Whoa! Like, yeah. Bongo, bongo, bongo. <laughs> Let's go. Oh! oh! Oh, you okay? Oh no. That had oh, to no. hurt. That had oh, to no. hurt, bro. Oh no. That had to hurt. Oh, I got him. 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 Don't worry. I got him. Oh, talk about those bow skills. Watch out from the top. Watch out from the top. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out, bro. Don't let me watch out you. Don't let me watch out you. Watch out. <laughs> got him. Are they driving more keys? Yeah, here. I'll... Thank you. Dude, I have more than enough keys, honestly. Just Whoa. That, that, was, that was my guy. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of people here. You're right. All right. Well, let's go to speed through this, buddy. To the moon we go. All right. My dragon is like up there, like following us. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yo, that guy's got some health, bro. What the heck? There's another Fire Nation sword in here in case you want it. It's kind of useless. We, our swords are way better. Yo, I almost one-shot you, bro. You good? Okay, so is there anything else? It just keeps going, dude. Another chest? Just the same stuff. Huh. Is there some kind of a boss that we're looking for? And we kept traveling up this giant pillar in the Fire Nation world. We were trying to figure out what was the purpose of this all. Oh, yo, I'm here. I'm here at the top. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. And then I risked it all. <gasps> oh! Boy. Wow. I, I fell down the whole entire thing, by the way. Uh, but I, the, lava, the lava helped a lot. <laughs> wow. Oh. That was ridiculous. Dude, there's a crazy dragon fight right now between really? my dragon and the other dragon. Oh, he's mad. Oh, yeah, he's mad, bro. Ow, ow, ow. Yo, good thing I got some fireproof potions. There's gotta be a purpose to all of this. We're here for a reason. We just have to figure it out. I'm here at the next location. Uh, I'm not sure what the point of this one is. I'm just gonna speed through it, bro. I just wanna get the chests. Oh, no, you don't. Ooh, yo, I got Fire Nation boots. I'm part of the Fire Nation now. I'm almost at the top. Connor, I, I think, uh, I think that's it. That's, it that's gotta, it we already really went cool. through so many of these pillars, but that has to be it. I don't know what this okay. is. But apparently, Whoa. it looks like something for. Whoa. Oh, I clicked it. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Yo, why do I feel like we're just gonna kill this guy so easily? I know. Bro? Fire essence. So, yep. what's, what's the fire essence for? On day 191 to 195, we were still missing a few hotter trainer dragons. One was a storm cutter. So, we decided to find his egg. This shall be all we see here, buddy. You ready? We will oh. never forget. The mighty dragon, okay? So I don't know what these heavy things are for or these keys at all. I really can't figure it out. Like, what do they do? And before leaving on my journey to get myself a storm cutter, I leveled up my screaming death even more. Yo, what is that thing? I don't know. See what this? is this? I don't know. But we found a storm cutter, and I'm just trying to figure out what that thing is. Oh, this is it right here, and there's a storm cutter right over there in the corner, as you can see. Um, and that's, I think that's a death gripper, apparently. Um, interesting. And there's another weird dragon over there. All right, well, we're ready to... Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing? I'm just chilling with me. It's okay. Hey, Dad, can I have any more treats? Thank you. Let's grab it and start incubating it. From day 196 to 199, we went looking for Squirrel, another dragon that we were missing. And, of course, a very popular one from the movies. As I was on my way looking for the Squirrel nest, 
I found another Screaming Death Nest as well. This meant we were gonna have two Screaming Deaths and Diamonds. So I went inside and looted it. And here I was, next to the Squirrel Nest. We also got attacked by another dragon because why not? Yo, these dudes just never learn, Connor. What, yeah, like, they what's never wrong do. With them? I don't know why they keep on coming back. I two hit we them. Like, we like, yeah, he literally two hit him. He's like a I baby one like, too. Yo, what is that up there? You see that? Yeah. He has another dragon nest over there. Huh? So is this is this the one? I think so. Blue. This, Looks the like Skrill, a wait, Well, that, that's that's not Skrill. I don't know what which dragon that is. Oh. But that's not him. Um, interesting. Okay, oh, so we just gotta go in here. Oh, there it is. That's it. Oh. Just like that. Just, just snag it. Just snag it. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> okay. All right. Next one. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. I really didn't expect it to happen, and there was Squirrel right there. I actually killed his dragon egg, and there was a bewildered beast. Look how big he was, flying through the sky. Yo, wait a minute. I gotta match this dude. Come here. Come here. Get over here. Hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I, I honestly don't like the screaming death that much. He's kind of annoying. I'm gonna fire some shots, boys. Let's go. Woo Check this thing out. That thing is huge. Wow. Wow. A level 95 people the beast. And I got attacked by another dragon because they just love trying to kill me. Oh! Oh, dragon's attacking the village! Dragon's attacking the village, and the dragon is about to die. I'm, try I'm trying to save them, it's just this dude is kind of evil. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna save the villagers, actually. You're, you're right, bro. I should do that. I'm a good person here. <laughs> I want my screaming death to fight him. Show him who's boss, buddy. And he's gone. We found another one! Let's go! Alright, okay, here we go, buddy. Uh, put the lava away this time. I don't know, no. man. Oh, I got diamonds. I got diamonds. Yo, they keep dropping these diamond shards, by the way. <gasps> okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yo, so I'm not sure what these diamond shards are for, but I think we can craft diamonds with them. So there we go. We officially have Skrill and Screaming Death. I want you to have a Screaming Death as well, buddy. All right, Connor. The Skrill yep. is ready to go. Yeah, I can't believe this thing is still going, bro. It's taking forever. Wow. On day 200, we hatched both of our dragons, including the Stormcutter, the Skrill, I even got Screaming Death, and the Crimson Moose to level 100. Come on, buddy, get over here. I'm pretty sure I had this dude at a higher level. I think the game just keeps glitching out for us for some reason, yeah. but yeah, he's at level 67 now, apparently. I don't know, he was at 85 or something. To level 100, let's go! Yo, the Stormcutter egg is done, and our Skrill egg is also almost done, buddy. All right, here we go, Storm Cutter. Ta-da! Oh, he's so cute. Look at this dude. All right, eat up, buddy. Connor, give the storm cutter one as well. It looks adorable. Oh, he's adorable, bro. Look at this dude. Whoa! Whoa, he's big! Oh! Yo! The yeah. screaming death is huge! 97. Look at him go. Yo, give me the last of it. Here, you have to craft more. Here, here, here. Whoa. I don't know what he's doing, bro, but I think he's pretty happy. Yeah. There okay. we go. Level 100, baby! Yeah! My screaming death was ready. The ultimate screaming death, buddy. Dude, he's so big, you can't even oh, fly yeah. him anymore, yeah, by the way. That's the funny part. Look at the storm cutter. He's level 18 now. Super cute. All right. So anyways, Connor, the next thing is Skrill. Yeah. He's ready. Let's go. Look at Skrill. All right, perfect. Look at Aww. him, bro. He looks super awesome. There we go. Look at him. Oh, he's such Aww. a little baby. Yo, he's about to become so big. It's going to be oh, ridiculous. Oh, yeah. It's going to be so funny. There's the storm cutter. There's the screaming death. Yeah, he's actually not that big, honestly. I think the Bewilder Beast is ridiculously huge. But this guy's apparently the biggest, like, land dragon. And so we leveled up Crimson Moose to 100. Let me try to fly Crimson real quick. Let's see how he's doing. Okay. Here we go. Whoa. He flies! Yay! He does fly. Oh, that's awesome. Yo, let's go. No way. So he's only got like one simple ability. He just shoots fireballs. Oh, oh, that's pretty that's, cool. That's pretty. Yo, he's he's not a baby anymore, bro. That's nope. a big dragon. He's only getting bigger, bro. Look at this dude. Whoa, whoa, he's already getting bigger than the building. And level 100. Woo! Boy, wow. is he big? Yeah. This dude is massive. Yeah. So, yeah. I kind of want to compare him, though, to... Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't think he's that big, right? 
Oh, oh yeah, he's big. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's oh, big. Yeah. That's a oh big yeah. Boy. <laughs> That's a really big boy. Yeah. Right, how am I gonna fly this guy? For all my How to Train a Dragon fans, I got a question for you. What is your favorite dragon from the series? Is it a Skrill, Bewilderbeast, Light Fury, Night Fury, or something like that? Well, here's the thing. I feel like we shouldn't include Life Fury or Night Fury just because of like how like, yeah. they just have such a big fan base. You know what I mean? They're like the OGs, but I want to like know what's your second favorite. Technically, how about that?